am really, really honored to be here uh, with MK Asante, author, poet, filmmaker. Man, this dude's like royalty. Like, what do I say to him? <laughs> My impression was that it's just really dynamic. I mean, I love the way that fiction and historical realism and music and kind of family histories come together in all of these dynamic ways. So it was pretty fantastic. Let me yeah. let me actually read some stuff I got Please. um to give you guys a sense of like the story. The fall in Philadelphia. Outside is the color of cornbread and blood. Change hangs in the air like the sneaks on the live wires behind my crib. Me and my big brother Uzi in the kitchen. He's rolling a blunt on top of the source. The one with Tyson on the cover, rocking a koofy, ice grilling through the gloss. To say that I actually went through all this personally, it was rough, um, but there are other options in life is a really important story that I think a lot of people are not exposed to. The teacher gives everybody a blank piece of paper and she's like, right. The blank page is the starter pistol that fires and triggers my mind to sprint. What will I write? What will I say? How will I start? Whose story will I tell? My story? A story about a boy, maybe, from Philly? A lost boy who wants to find himself but doesn't know where to look? Who wants to tell his story but doesn't know where to begin or end? Who searches anyway and discovers something about himself, the world? I, I recently had the, the opportunity to make my first hip hop song, and I did it with legends. Coming to see MK and hearing his story, I can relate to that, you know, especially as a brother also from Africa, from Ghana, you know, I thought his story was the truth. It touched close to home and, you know, I learned a lot from it. Angela told me, that. I went to see my Angela, I was struggling with my book. I went to see her, she's my mentor, I went to see her. I said, I'm struggling with my book, my book, bro. He said, tell the truth. When you tell the truth, it resonates with white women in Ohio, it resonates with, it resonates with an Indian man, it resonates with, the truth is universal. 